What if I told you that your eye color holds a secret, a story passed down through thousands of years of human evolution? From the icy blue eyes of the Nordic North to the rich hazel hues of the Mediterranean, every iris has a tale to tell. A tale woven into the very fabric of our DNA. In this video, we embark on a fascinating journey, diving deep into the genetic and ancestral roots of eye color across continents. We'll uncover the science behind melanin, the pigment that paints our eyes and trace the migratory paths of our ancestors, revealing how their journeys shape the kaleidoscope of eye colors we see today. In the animal kingdom, eye colors are adapted to environments. In humans the iris displays this variation. The key to understanding this spectrum lies in melanin, a pigment. Melanin determines the hue of our eyes, skin, and hair. The amount of melanin in the iris dictates eye color. Genes like OCA2 and HERC2 orchestrate melanin production. These genes passed down through generations reflect our ancestry. Brown eyes are most common, making up 70 to 80% of the population. Gray and green eyes are rarer. Men are slightly more likely to have blue eyes. Imagine, if you will, the cradle of humanity, the sun-drenched savannas of Africa, here, brown eyes evolved as the default, a shield against the relentless glare of the sun. Melanin, that protective pigment, acts as a natural sunblock, absorbing harmful UV rays and safeguarding the delicate structures within the eye. It's no coincidence that brown eyes dominate in regions bathed in sunlight, Africa, East Asia and South Asia. These are the lands where our species first took root, where brown eyes provided a crucial survival advantage. Now there's a common misconception that some individuals possess truly black eyes, but in reality, these eyes are simply a very deep, rich brown, where melanin is so abundant that the iris appears almost black. The legacy of brown eyes extends far beyond these equatorial regions. As we journey across the Mediterranean, we encounter the echoes of ancient migrations. Southern Europe, a melting pot of cultures, bears witness to the historical admixture with North African populations, leaving an indelible mark on the genetic landscape. Here, brown eyes remain prevalent, a testament to the enduring legacy of human movement and interaction. From the sun-drenched south, we venture north to the cooler climes of Europe. Here, a new chapter in the story of eye color unfolds. Blue eyes, a striking departure from the ancestral brown, emerged as a hallmark of European ancestry. Our journey takes us back in time, to the era of Cheddar Man, one of the oldest complete skeletons of a modern human found in Britain, dating back an astonishing 10,000 years. Remarkably, genetic analysis revealed that Cheddar Man, like many early Europeans, possessed blue eyes. But how did this dramatic shift occur? The answer lies in mutations, those tiny changes in our DNA that can have profound effects. In the case of blue eyes, these mutations acted like dimmer switches, reducing the production of melanin in the iris. This reduction in melanin however, wasn't merely a cosmetic change, it conferred a unique advantage in the dimly lit landscapes of northern and eastern Europe. With less melanin to absorb light, blue eyes were better equipped to capture the scarce sunlight, improving vision in low light conditions. As populations migrated and mingled, blue eyes spread across the continent, becoming increasingly common in northern and eastern Europe. And with the age of exploration and colonization, the reach of blue eyes extended far beyond Europe, carried across oceans and continents on the tides of human history. Chapter 4. Hazel Eyes, a Tapestry of Ancestry. Imagine a mosaic, a beautiful blend of colors and textures, each piece contributing to the overall masterpiece. That's the essence of Hazel Eyes, a captivating blend of brown, green, and amber tones. This mesmerizing hue arises from a delicate interplay of factors. Melanin, while present, doesn't dominate as it does in brown eyes. Instead, it mingles with varying amounts of another pigment called lipochrome. Lipochrome, you see, is responsible for those captivating yellow and golden flecks that dance within the iris, adding depth and complexity to hazel eyes. It's no coincidence that hazel eyes are most prevalent in populations with a rich tapestry of ancestry. The Iberian Peninsula, home to the Spanish and Portuguese, is a prime example. Here, centuries of intermingling between Mediterranean, North African and even Celtic populations have created a genetic melting pot, resulting in a high frequency of hazel eyes. But the story doesn't end there. Venture across the Atlantic to Brazil, and you'll encounter a similar phenomenon. The legacy of Portuguese colonization. 
coupled with the influx of African slaves and indigenous populations, has created a vibrant tapestry of cultures and genes, with hazel eyes shimmering as a testament to this complex history. Chapter 5. Amber Eyes, The Golden Gaze In the realm of human eye color amber eyes stand apart, a rare and radiant phenomenon. Unlike their hazel counterparts, pure amber eyes possess a uniform golden hue, reminiscent of a lion's gaze or the heart of a burning ember. This captivating color arises from a unique interplay of pigments. Lipochrome, the pigment responsible for yellow and gold tones, takes center stage, while melanin takes a back seat, present in low to moderate amounts. This delicate balance creates the illusion of pure gold, a color often associated with warmth, energy, and vitality. While amber eyes can occur in individuals of diverse backgrounds, they are most commonly found in specific regions of the world. Southern Europe, with its historical ties to North Africa and the Middle East, boasts a slightly higher incidence of amber eyes. The Middle East itself, a crossroads of ancient civilizations, also harbors pockets where this golden gaze shines brightly. And as we journey further afield, to the sun-drenched landscapes of Latin America and North Africa, we encounter traces of amber eyes, a testament to the far-reaching tendrils of human migration and genetic exchange. Chapter 6. Green Eyes, an Emerald Enigma In a world awash in brown and blue, green eyes emerge as a rare and captivating anomaly. Only about 2% of the global population can lay claim to these emerald gems, making them a subject of fascination and intrigue. The origins of green eyes can be traced back to the heart of Europe, specifically to the Celtic and Germanic populations who once roamed the lands we now know as Ireland, Scotland, Iceland, and Germany. These regions, often shrouded in mist and legend, boast the highest concentrations of green-eyed individuals today. But what is the secret behind this enigmatic hue? Green eyes, like hazel eyes, arise from a delicate interplay of melanin and lipochrome. However, in the case of green eyes, light scattering plays a crucial role in creating their distinctive appearance. Imagine, if you will, sunlight filtering through a forest canopy, casting dappled shadows of green. Similarly, light scatters within the iris of a green-eyed individual, creating the illusion of green. The emergence of green eyes is a relatively recent phenomenon in human evolutionary history, likely arising during the Bronze Age. Some speculate that their appearance coincided with the rise of agriculture and the increased consumption of leafy green vegetables, which may have influenced pigment production in the body. Chapter 7. Gray Eyes, A Shimmer of Steel In the realm of rare eye colors, gray eyes reign supreme, a testament to the extraordinary diversity of the human genome. Occurring in a mere 1-3% of the population, gray eyes possess an ethereal beauty, often described as a mirror to the soul. At first glance, gray eyes might appear similar to their blue-eyed counterparts. Both result from low levels of melanin in the iris. However, a closer look reveals distinct differences in their light-scattering mechanisms. Gray eyes, unlike blue eyes, often exhibit a subtle, almost metallic shimmer, reminiscent of polished steel or a stormy sky. This unique quality arises from the presence of microscopic collagen deposits within the iris. These deposits scatter light differently than the structures found in blue eyes, creating the illusion of gray. The highest concentrations of gray eyes are found in the northernmost reaches of Europe, particularly in Russia, the Baltics, and Scandinavia. These regions, characterized by long winters and limited sunlight, may have favored the emergence of gray eyes, as lighter eye colors are thought to be advantageous in low-light conditions. Intriguingly, gray eyes also appear, albeit less frequently, among certain Berber groups in North Africa and scattered populations in the Middle East and South Asia. This suggests that multiple genetic pathways may lead to the development of this rare and captivating trait. Outro a reflection of our past. From the warm browns of our African ancestors to the icy blues of the Nordic North, eye color stands as a testament to the incredible diversity of the human family. It's a reminder that we are all connected, our stories intertwined through millennia of migration, adaptation, and genetic exchange. Your eye color is more than just a physical trait, it's a genetic record of your ancestors' journey through climate, culture, and time. It's a living link to the past, a whisper of ancient stories etched in the very fabric of your being. Now, we'd love to hear from you. Let us know your eye color and ancestry in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe for more fascinating breakdowns of genetics, history, and anthropology.